I think the second time Ella Wimsat, I'm not mistaken, has won this award. She won it last year, and she is this week's Orange Panther of the Week for the second week of this season. Orange off to a solid start, winning at Western Alamance. Last year, you got extended to five sets over at Elon before you won that one. This time, you swept them. What was working well for you on Tuesday night there? Um, I think we were just really working their defense, and we just got a lot of our hits in this time. We made less mistakes than they did, so I think that's what pulled us through. Yeah. You, um, where do you feel like you've improved the most since you've started as a volleyball player? Yeah. Um, I think my, like, my sense of where to put the ball to get a point mm -hmm. has really improved since, like, my freshman year here. Okay. So, like, when I hit the ball, I know instead of just trying to kill it, I just find some holes and put it down. Right. Does that just come, obviously it comes with experience, but... Um, it also makes a difference who's setting the ball for you. Mm -hmm. you, got, you got a sophomore usually that's yes. doing that, Katie Silicon. How yes. much does she help you? She helps a lot. She's always like deals with whatever <laughs> us hitters need and she places it right where we need it. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, last year, I mean, you had a lot of uh, outside hitters and uh, how much um, has it helped to have more diverse outside hitters this year with? Ava and, and, mm -hmm. and others. Yeah, it's definitely helped a lot since our group of sophomores came in to give us some height on the team for <laughs> some more blocking. Mm -hmm. and so yeah, it's definitely more diverse with yeah. more height on the team. Yeah. Um, you got something, you got a chance here to do something that hasn't been done here. I'm looking with the banners and not many has been a conference champion yeah. in volleyball in a long time. Yeah. Have you noticed that too? Yes, or? we're excited. That's one of our goals this season. Yeah. Um, we're hoping for that. What else do you want to accomplish before you end your career here? Um, I mean, we really want to make it further in playoffs this year. The last few years, we've only made it to the second round. So mm -hmm. we one of our goals is for conference champs, and then we want to make it past or at least more than the second round of playoffs this year. We're just now finishing out the third week of the year, but you've already played teams that look like they could make a deep run mm -hmm. in the 3A state playoffs off of West Randolph, yeah. Carborough. you got Cedar Ridge next week. So mm -hmm. how much do you think that's going to help you? I think it's definitely going to prepare us for that point when it comes, but we've only grown a lot as a team since that tournament at East Chapel Hill when we played those teams right. that we struggled with. Mm -hmm. We're building our team chemistry up. Mm -hmm. Didn't have Ava Wilkerson also against yeah, Southwest Randolph. Yeah, Randall. she was hurt. Though. And uh, I think that would have made a yes. much bigger difference. Yes. Question. Yeah. Um, well, Ella, I know you got uh, you talked to you during soccer also. So uh, you're very busy during the fall and the spring. Yes. And I'm happy to give you this honor here once again for Orange Panther of the Week. Congratulations. Thank you so much.